YouTube. Welcome back to my channel. <laughs> Look at this mess. <laughs> it's so messy, I know, but I just wanted to make a video really quick because oh, PJ went upstairs and he's not gonna bark and I have some time and then I have to clean up a little bit. And look, <laughs> that was so funny. I watched um, Winona's video and um, she mentioned me and she said that she loved my composition book, my altered composition books that I made. And if I don't forget, I will put a card up or something of the series. And this was the leftover piece that I used the white pieces of napkin on you know they always have like three layers and we rip off the white part but we never do anything with that and that was the piece that was left over and I actually just found it while I was cleaning my room and she mentioned it I was like I have it I still have it it's really really cool when you do that this texture and just it looks so pretty I wanted to turn this into a tag and I still didn't so it has been a long long time but um if I don't forget, I will link Winona's. It's hard for me to say Winona. I don't know why. My my mouth is just not used to it. I will link her channel down below if I don't forget. And if I forget, um, she can comment on the video and then I pin her comment. You can click on her um, channel if you want to. Ah, but that was the piece and I loved it. And now I'm like, oh, I should do something with this piece, but actually I want to do something else. So I need to start with something else first because when I made my last video, I had, what is this actually? Oh, it's a piece of cardstock. Why is it here? When I made my last video, now stop. You see, I'm, I'm kind of going away again from my original thought here. <laughs> I have all these little leftovers, right, from um, the cards that I made. Where are the cards? I'm going to show you real quick, just in case you didn't watch the video. Those are the cards, and I decided not to sew around them this time. I don't know. I want to put something on the back, though. I will see. Okay. You should see my room. <laughs> I'm moving. I'm moving tables. I'm... Oh, my God. Yeah. Yeah. I can't talk about it so bad but I'm trying to move everything so I can have a layout in the room for the things I do now because I moved on with my crafting and there is hair everywhere I apologize if you don't like that but I just pick up stuff from the floor and put them on my table let's start let's start I wanted to use up all those little things that I have here you know before I put them somewhere or don't put them anywhere and I want to make, I saw it somewhere, but I'm pretty sure, I just don't know where, somewhere somebody made like a little, I don't know what you call it. It was on the bottom of the page, if I remember correctly. On the bottom of the page, it was just a cluster of something and <coughs> it decorated the journal. And I was thinking I could make the cluster, but um, on a piece of cardstock. So it's um, not just decoration, but a little, there is a cardstock piece that I don't need. I have a little tuck spot as well. So I was thinking, I'm not gonna glue it down here. It's just for me to kind of lay something out or whatever. So I was thinking I would do that like this, but I want to put it onto a piece of cardstock. Do I make any sense to you? I hope so. Now, what do I wanna do? What am I doing? Anyways, anyways, <laughs> let's start somewhere. I need a piece of white. Piece of white would be here, okay. I just need one piece of white, just in case it looks out there. I would like it to be white. And I'm kinda roughly going to, rip it off just now just you know i feel like if i just make it a tuck spot without it without the cardstock underneath it's um i'm gonna rip the paper because it's just shipping paper okay now let's <laughs> Let's hope that whatever is in my brain comes together <laughs> and whatever is gonna be on the page later. Okay, so something like that, I was thinking. Still, so, yeah, yeah, that's not too bad. I just need to rip off a little more from here. And here, 
and there and here and there and then I'm gonna glue it down that's it let's put this aside just for a moment let's reuse this one so we can toss it okay why is that so bad rip 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 now glue now I have to open my glue it's just going to be a little cluster before I use my glue I want to it's probably not gonna be visible but I still would like to do this who knows where I'm gonna put it on my page and I'm thinking right now I'm probably gonna do a little bit in the back as well this one does not really just trust much okay just trusting my fingers again oh that looks awesome looks awesome and I'm thinking that I'm going to glue a little leftover whatever page here oh look I have a little strip right here I don't know how much it's gonna come out there but I'm just gonna glue a little strip right there Ow! In the back, just in case this shows. And I should wait until it dries a little, otherwise I cannot take it off here. So that was this. Now I'm going to glue this one on top, or should I rip first? Okay, let me see. Let me. I just don't want it to be a straight edge here. So I'm going. I should have done it first and then ripped the cardstock with the paper. Could have been better. Could have been better. Who knows? Oh, this is still a straight edge. We don't want any anything straight on here. So go away and distress and then hope for the best hope for the best how's it gonna go what am i doing i have no idea anymore this way okay i just <laughs> mess with my own brain because i don't remember this is supposed to be quick and easy just to get some leftovers from my desk i was gonna clean and then i saw all of that and i decided that maybe instead of cleaning it up and putting it away, I can just make something. Something like that. Okay, what else do I have? I have this little strip right here and I have, oh look, I like to tear off these where it says chapter one, <laughs> because I always think, oh, you could totally use it like in your, you know, when you make a journal and you want to have like the first chapter or something or whatever. <sighs> no, where did this piece go? The one that I just had, I ripped off a piece. Okay, whatever. It's so weird. It disappeared on me. I'm just going to, all I'm doing is ripping here. I'm just going to make them so they are not straight. And I'm keeping this one because I saw Corey using it. Yeah, I'm totally into what she made. Something like that, maybe. Maybe a little piece of this also because I have it. Let's just distress stuff and have it on top of each other. Do I have anything underneath? Just to check. No, no more strips of nothing underneath. This one is distressed. I don't know how this one is gonna look, truthfully. I don't know if I need a bigger piece of something underneath as well, or if this is gonna be just fine. Didn't distress it here for some reason. Something like that, something like that, something like that. What else could we put on top? Is there anything? Oh, oh, there's another one here as well. 
this could go somewhere here no i i i i do want to see what's written on it i'm getting in trouble here what else was on my desk do i have anything i have let's see oh there's a piece of lace piece of lace what if we just trust this one a little bit oh this one is like what if we put a piece, or shall we put it? Oh, we could totally put it on the bottom, right? This piece of lace. And then put this one here. Maybe. Maybe. Let's see. What else do I have here in my box? Oh, I have this. Look, I think I got it at the dollar store. And you can just rip it off like this. And then you get little pieces here. So let's see if I can use any of that. I have to use up my stuff. Okay. I hope that's big enough. I'm just cutting because it has a wire and I don't want the wire. I could have used the piece of lace too. So what did I do? I had this piece on top. And then I could put this piece on top. And then nothing is going to be visible anymore. <laughs> now I covered everything up. <laughs> Maybe I should put this one on the bottom. Like that. And then I have this one on top. Like this. No, I kinda I kinda don't like the straight lace here at all. Really. Kinda don't. And I'm thinking that I don't like the straightness here either. So I'm just gonna take off a couple of those. There you go. Maybe pull them a little. Uh oh, <laughs> that pulled a lot. Yeah, this one has to be cut off. Okay, so they are not all that cool. Here and here and here and there. Just stick some of them together like this. And it's still a little straight everything. What else I got? Here on my desk, I have a ton, a ton of baggies with some stuff in it that I cut for myself like a long time ago when I just started out crafting, you know, I would use up every scrap of paper, like everything. And I would just cut it or punch it or do something with that. So yeah, there is that. Let me see. Do I have a circle here? I also have circles here. Okay, let me just trust this and see if I like it or not. And this one is more, this one is just very thin. Maybe before I lay everything out, I should just start gluing stuff to, to this. I don't know if this is gonna hold up. Well, we'll see. I don't know if I can sew through this later. I don't know. I'll try. I will try whatever. Okay. This one is there. <clears throat> now, I forget what was on top. But it's fine. I believe it was this piece of paper was right here. And then I'm going to glue this down here as well. Just so it holds up. Oof, I shouldn't be breathing. I feel like breathing is not a good thing to do. Okay, then a piece of this napkin thing. Oh, I forget. I need to stick this one underneath. Come off. I need to stick another one there first because I wanted it to just peek out a little bit. And here I was thinking that this one should be super quick. <laughs> it's going to be super quick. I'm just putting this on my page here to see how it's going to look. This might be a little bit too long, but yeah, no, I don't know. I want it to be really dark. How about that? Really dark. Put one really dark one on top and then the 
not this dark one maybe here and I need some of this I saw so many things for my Etsy store and I cut them shorter afterwards and I keep them all because I think you know you could always use thread for something but that means I should maybe start using it for stuff maybe I'm gonna just put it right here or something I'm gonna glue down my finger yeah that's probably not too bad I don't know I feel like something needs to go there as well should we move it there yeah we just move it and what could we put there put something yeah I feel like something needs to go to this side too something small something not big and I definitely don't want to rip anything else I just want to use up whatever little pieces are on my desk so I don't make more little pieces right that was not the purpose of this video to make more little pieces <laughs> definitely wasn't okay let's see go away oh yeah I think I'm gonna do it like that right here There you go, there you go, just like that. So there is another layer. And do I have anything printed here around me? Anything printed? I do not know, I will find out. That doesn't look printed. I still have this little piece. But I kind of don't like it here because, oh, yeah, a huge printed page. page. And I'm just going to rub a little piece. Okay. Okay, what am I doing actually? Something, doing something. Because the circle is gonna go on top, I think it's not gonna be too bad. And I'm just gonna get a tiny piece of this, whatever. It's just interest, <laughs> just for more layers of something, <laughs> tiny piece of that. Now I can probably put my string here. Let me see. I need to make a circle out of this, kind of. Put my string here and then put this piece. Oh yeah, that will be perfect. As long as it holds up, I'm gonna put a little more glue on this one so it goes onto my thread too. Just like that. Wonderful. You're supposed to hold my thread down, right there. Okay, but what would I stick on top? Hmm something not too big probably you know what this is too white for me definitely compared to everything else this is too white okay or i just keep this one with this one let's see what i got here next to me i have all of these little flowers butterflies things oh not bad with the circle or without the circle? I don't know where the circle needs to be darker because it stands out too much in my opinion. I think I'm gonna do it with the circle. I like it. Oh, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm going to, oh no, I'm not gonna find it anymore. <laughs> I was gonna look for my cheesecloth, but I took it away from the spot where it always goes because because I'm I'm putting things in different places now and there it is there it is I try to um, <clears throat> make my desk like at least take everything off from one spot 
so I can kind of organize on the desk differently, but that has been, I don't know, it, it was just a lot. That's a lot. So I'm going to put a little bit of glue on here. Put a little bit of, I have a lot of stuff on there. A lot of stuff. I put glue on the circle and try to kind of put it in the middle of this thing. And then just a little bit of distress ink onto the yellow part of this and onto the green part of this. And glue this butterfly down. Put some glue on your finger so, you know, your finger gets something off of it as well. It's too much. Turn a little. That doesn't look too bad. A little number. I like numbers. I just do. And this one is just paper. And it's brown. And I think I'm going to just do it. So it's thin. It's just paper. And there are so many layers. I like my numbers. And that's it. Look, this looks pretty good. 21 minutes. <laughs> and later, once I need it, I'm thinking of just putting it onto a page like this. So it sticks out a little bit here and a little bit there. And I need to distrust this. I will show you. So if you put it down like this, you see this from the bottom, you know, a couple layers, and this from the side. And I think that's really cool. Like when you open another page and you see it this way, I think it's cool to see something there. And here, you could just put it down like that, like a decoration. I think this could also be a nice belly band. Look, because it's on cardstock, we could glue it on two sides, just like that, and stick something here. Or if you do it here, glue it on the bottom and on one side and then stick something there. I think that would be adorable. That's what I wanted to make with my little pieces. And now it's time to clean more. <laughs> so I'm gonna finish this and probably just clean a little more and then see whatever I'm gonna do. Love it. I love it. Whoever made something like this, because a lot of times I do not know. It's something I saw a long time ago and um, it might be somewhere in my screenshots or whatever. Something similar. It's not the same. It's just, as always, it inspires us <laughs> when we see something, right? But I hope you enjoyed this one. And I'm thinking... No. You know, I like to saw a little bit somewhere, but I don't think I'm going to saw on this one. I think this one is just going to stay this way. Yeah, if you enjoyed it, as always, thumbs up, share, subscribe, and I see you soon, hopefully. Bye-bye.